They couldn't get the Baby Dragon on tower. The oh. E-Wiz, the Lightning, 4 HP on there, and Diego B and Pompeo win game number two. Hey guys, my name is Sebastián Pompeo. I'm Pompeo for in-game and I play Clash Royale competitively for Chivas Esports. I played Clash of Clans before and then there was like an in-game announcement, a new game from Supercell, Clash Royale. So I joined, I started competing tournaments in 2016. Serial wasn't a thing back then until 2017, which was actually this thing that I'm ha they have right here, is the Crown Championship Global Series, the CCGS. That's my first tournament and that's where I started competing. Then when, C when CRL was a thing, I got into CRL, so it's my first time being like a, a professional player. I played Clash of Clans like pretty casually, honestly, and I downloaded Clash for the same thing, like Clash Royale for the same thing, because it's a fun game. And I started being like great, so I got into the competitive scene and I, I, I grew on from there. Like my first game, I actually, well, won my set. It was my very first day in CRL and I swept the team, so that's awesome. Like, that's one of my biggest stories and one of my most proudest moments. He's fireball down, left-hand side. We are in a tower oh race and Cream takes it! Wow! Cody and Pompeo firing back. Not only did they take their first set win in the 2v2, not only is it Pompeo's debut, but they beat SK. I think one of my key players that I watch right now is Anavan. He's really good on ladder and he's also really good at like the competitive stuff of CRL. He's Mexican, uh, same as me, and he's also one of my friends, so I'm watching him very closely. Also, Lucas X Gamer, he's really good. Like he he won twice the the monthly finals now. I actually train with them and whatever. This year is kind of a bit, a bit different because there's no teams. Actually, like the format itself is kind of different because this year you need to play three different decks with no repeated cards, so it's very different. I mean, this year I have a I had a lot. Of a lot of ups and downs. Like on the first thing that you have to do to qualify to CRL is like the top 1000. I got top 10 twice this year, so that's really awesome, honestly. I'm in like, in the, in like the line to qualify for Worlds and I need to, to get better. Pompeo gonna get one back for Chivas and a big one indeed. If you're a casual want to go to CRL, first of all, you need to qualify for it. It's a top thousand, like the top thousand players from the world. I think it's, that's a nice start to like make, become a CRL, com CRL player. If you have a deck that you're really good at, you can try to qualify for it that way. Like you can push top ladder and get a top thousand. And also one of the biggest tips I can, I can give to you guys is get like a competitive team, even if it's just an amateur team or whatever. People in those teams will help you. You can help those teams out as well. Just build a community and you can grow together. But yes, I hope we can make something better this year. I hope I hope we can make worlds this year and I think I can make it. Like honestly, I need to make it in worlds.